Real nice afternoon and evening across the area. Comfortable temperatures and actually comfortable dew points as well. Since this afternoon and into early this evening, dew point values have been running the upper 50s to now low 60s, which is a comfortable range, maybe moderately humid. Not too bad though. 73, the current temperature, humidity is at 66%. Light easterly wind at three miles an hour. Now we will see some additional changes late tonight and through the day tomorrow. Those dew point values are going to creep higher, so it's going to feel a lot muggier through the day tomorrow. 73 right now in Moon Township. It has cooled off nicely in some outlying communities. Cranberries at 65. It's 67 in Churchill and 69 in Bethel Park. Butler checking in at 64. Same in Latrobe and still 75 degrees in West Mifflin. So a wide range of temperatures across the area. I think most places are going to settle in to the mid 60s by first thing tomorrow morning. But as evidenced by the current temperatures, some of the outlying communities will be a tad cooler than that. Maybe lower 60s first thing tomorrow by noon. 80 degrees we will probably get some sunshine in the morning, perhaps filter through some high cloudiness. Then in the afternoon skies become mostly cloudy, and I do think we'll see some scattered showers developing. 4 o'clock and then through the remainder of the afternoon and into tomorrow evening. Not going to be a total washout, but we'll have showers crossing the area, as I mentioned, in a scattered fashion. We'll start our clock 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. Some sunshine again. High cloudiness will start to filter in. Now we move ahead to 5 o'clock in the afternoon. You can see the scattered nature of showers, which will be crossing the area into early tomorrow evening. Now we stop at midnight tomorrow night. Still a few showers, although they're starting to shift further east. So our window of opportunity to see most of our showers will be about 4 or 5 o'clock through about 11 o'clock or midnight tomorrow night. Then as we get into the day on Friday, still a couple spotty showers, maybe around first thing in the morning. There'll be few and far between very hit and miss in the afternoon. After a front passes through the area, you can see skies will begin to clear out and sunshine will begin to reemerge as we start to change out our air mass for something a little cooler, more comfortable and more stable heading into the weekend. So high pressure is now in the process of moving away. A warm front is going to pivot and come back north. That's going to increase the atmospheric moisture. Dew points are going to start rising. It's going to feel soupier tomorrow. You can see at six o'clock again, the scattered showers in the area as a warm front comes through. Moving in behind that will be the cool front. Looks like it's going to be coming through on about late morning, midday on Friday. Once that swings through, things will settle down over the course of the afternoon and stay that way right through the weekend. Quickly looking ahead to next week, of course, the solar eclipse is on Monday in Pittsburgh. It will start at about 1:10 in the afternoon, reaching its maximum eclipse coverage at 235, and that should be about 80, 81% of the sun being obscured as the moon passes over its path. Forecast tonight, fair skies and 67. Tomorrow, the high temperature, 83, warm and humid. A few scattered showers in the afternoon. The extended forecast, Friday 81, mainly morning showers, 79 Saturday on Sunday, 81 degrees. And for the Steelers game, four o'clock kickoff against the Falcons, beautiful, mostly sunny skies and 80 degrees. And we'll hang on to low 80s with clear skies into Monday of next week.